Boulder, Colorado sits at the foothills of the Rocky Mountains and is known for its craggy rock formations called the Flatirons. Boulder is 25 miles northwest of downtown Denver, or about a 30 minute drive. Boulder is the 12th largest city in Colorado and has a population of just over 106,000 people that are spread out over 26 square miles. The most popular things to do in Boulder are exploring the University of Colorado campus, home of the Buffaloes and the Fisk Planetarium, hike one of the many trails up to the Flatirons, and cruise the outdoor Pearl Street Mall, which stretches four blocks. Boulder also consists of many parks and recreational areas, which the most popular being Chautauqua Park because of its size and location to the CU campus. This is a great start location for many of the hikes up to the Flatirons as well. One of the best hikes within the Flatirons is the Royal Arch Trail. Some people would rate this hike as hard, but I would say it's more towards the moderate scale. We recently did this hike, so here's a little of what you can expect if you ever decide to do it. I do, baby. <laughs> Looking good, dude. I think it's Boulder Field. That's why they call it Boulder. If you're coming in from out of town, especially from sea level, then this will be a harder hike for you. You'll just have to stop a lot more and take more breaks. Finding all those steps is what will get you, but it can still be done. Do you want to do some stair climbing today? The one thing I would say I didn't like about this hike is that it is extremely crowded. And once you get to the top, there isn't a lot of room, so you'll have to wait around to snag someone's seat. But the views are incredible. <laughs> Am I on your camera? I'm so sorry. Yeah, you were. I'm gonna post this on YouTube. I'm joking, I'm joking. No, he's not joking. After an intense hike, the best thing to do is head over to the Pearl Street Mall and let your hair down and refill your tank. Here you will find plenty of art galleries, cafes, coffee shops, restaurants, and unique one-of-a-kind boutiques. Colorado University at Boulder was founded in 1876, just five months before Colorado became a state. CU's architecture is pretty cool and has a unique style. It's known as the Tuscan Vernacular Revival. CU also maintains one of the largest club sport departments in the U.S. with support for over 30 club teams from lacrosse to soccer. Well that's going to wrap this look at Boulder Up. Likes are appreciated and if you would like to support this channel you know what to do. Until the next one.